Hello, only me again. Next thing I'm going to cover with you is your electricity and your gas for your motorhome. Now the vehicles are rigged up to be able to wild camp, as they call it, which means if you're not on a caravan site, if you do end up in a lay-by for the night or even a motorway services, you do have the amenities on board to be able to survive like that quite happily. Bit of a strong word I know, but never mind. But when you do get to your caravan site, in the locker at the back of the vehicle, which we'll go in shortly, there is a nice long orange cable. This is your hookup cable, and caravan sites usually do provide somewhere to plug them in. So all you need to do, under this flap here with a nice lightning bolt, lift up, plug in. And I don't know if it picked it up on the camera, but you get a beep inside the vehicle just to signify that it's detected as an electricity hookup point, and that will give you everything inside the vehicle, including your 240 hookup points and your microwave in the vehicle as well. So the next thing we'll cover very quickly is the gas system in the vehicle. Here we have the nice locker, LPG written on the front. Similar way to open it is the toilet on the other side. So you've got your two buttons here, press in and open up. As you'll see inside, there'll always be two gas bottles in when you take the vehicle. The hookup one will always be on the rear one. So we've got the hose there on the rear bottle. You've got the valve on top with the arrows on, which show you which way to turn it for open and close. Now, if you do happen to use all the gas in the bottle while you're out in the open, just close the valve off. Take the hose off with the gas spanner that we supply. Perfect, right size for it. Fit the hose onto this one, open the bottle up, and away you go, good to go. Nice and clamped in, and two bottles should be absolutely plenty for you for the time that you're away.